Shades of Charles Dickens. Yes, the bust is that of the immortal novelist who died in 1870 and gave this place fame. The house doesn't look very bleak, does it? But it's bleak house all the same. It was in this fine old battlemented dwelling, then actually called Fort Lodge at Broadstairs, that Dickens wrote the book which some people think is only second in popularity to Pickwick papers. Statues adorn the entrance to what is still called Dickens Avenue, really a number of leafy lanes bordered by ancient trees. The avenue gives onto a wide stretch of wooded parkland, and these views are as they can be seen from the house. The author's favorite seat under the trees. Through the window of Dickens' study, you get a delightful glimpse of the bay and harbor. The author described it as an intensely quiet fishing village built on a cliff. From the harbour, the house returns the compliment with another charming view. And now, what the Dickens is this?